And these in here, there are not really enough of them to do anything either from there. So I've got these and these small units, these. Now they're the ones that can lay an ambush. Shall I put them there? Forest, forest. Lay an ambush here. Okay, I'll put those through to there. I thought there were two armies that I could lay an ambush with. I was hoping to have something a bit stronger than just one army in there. Maybe this is the other one. But of course I'm leaving then this at the behest of the Bavarians. And I was hoping to move those down south. <coughs> Excuse me, towards the uh, the port. Anyhow. Light forest, lay ambush here. Okay, so two units there. The plan is that uh, when, hopefully he says, uh, holding his breath, Cassell falls, then what we can do is move on to Cleves. What with the Hanover troops and the Cassell troops, we can move on through there. That's the intention anyway. So let's see how that pans out, shall we? I think that's probably the best we can do with what we've got. Just see if we've got any troops at the back. Then we can start moving forward. I'm sure there's an army in here as well, isn't there? No, not quite. I think what I need to do is join those up with some other troops to make them into an army. Especially those, because they've got some... Hey? What on earth? Why are they dancing? Oh, isn't it ridiculous sometimes? Okay, the 45s, I don't need to replenish those anyway. These troops in particular I do. Definitely need to get in there. So a 5, 10, 14. So there's only 6 that I can put in there. And I've got 7 here. Right, 2, 4... Yeah, if I six seven, I can get six in. I'm going to just put these in for now. Basically because I need to replenish them, so they'll start to replenish now. And um, even though there's no general there, because they're inside a town, of course. And I'll just move these up. They could do with joining somebody somewhere, shouldn't they? To sort of bolster those troops. Um, perhaps just follow up behind these, and they'll get into that army eventually, I think. Some quite decent troops there. So... Right, OK, I think that's it for the um, for the sort of dispositions. Can't see anybody else in the rear that could be moving forwards. So what I think I'll do now is just um, see if that will fall. Let's just see if Cassell will fall. What troops have I got? I don't suppose it matters which ones I actually attack with. I just hope that it'll I'll gain support from all four of those armies. Yes, I have. All four of them are going in there. So that, again, should be another victory for me. Yes, it is. Not lost a lot in those. Oh, yeah, a lot. In total, 1,500, and he's lost 1,500 as well. So, yeah. Okay, so that's fallen. Uh, oh, I could liberate that one as well, but I'm going to peacefully occupy it. I think if I can move any troops out here to sort of help these, then I, then I ought to do. I don't think I can. Can I? Maybe I can move those, can I? Yeah, they can, actually. I'll just move... Oh, hang on a minute. Which ones have I got now? I don't want to take them out of the town, do I? Yeah, they would move to there. I think I'm going to move them to there, actually. Just to sort of bring in these troops, because if something attacks just those, then they would be a bit exposed on their own. So I think we should be OK now, though. OK, so they're on um, blimey, a fast replenishment rate. Oh, blimey, somebody asked me recently <laughs> what the derivative of the word blimey was. I just said it then without realising. OK, so that's those two places taken. I'm tempted also to take my troops, or some of my troops at least, from Marseille and go and attack over here towards Toulouse. But um, I don't know what's going to happen here with these any armies that he's got around here um, that could pose a threat to me. We do have now a fortress in here, I believe. Oh, we're one away. One away from having the fortress. Oh dear, will there be time to build that before he attacks me? <laughs> oh, let's just hope so. Cause there's bound to be an army that come after me there, isn't there? There is bound to be. OK, uh, let's get the spies moving then. I think they're OK in there, aren't they? I think they're fairly safe, yeah. And these here, yeah, they should be OK as well. OK, let's get the spies moving. So, spies, agents... Here we are. First one, Belarus. He's moving. These pushers moved. Uh, Alsace Lorraine. Um, they're going in against Strasbourg, probably. But if I can get them to sabotage an army, it might well be better. Let me see if he's recruiting in here. That's the thing. Oh, yes, he is. No, I think we'll sabotage this place, actually. 
Um, yeah, take that out if possible, please. No, it's not going to happen. Okay, I'm just going to move these sort of southerly from that point there so that I can use them maybe in the south if I need them to help out with any attacks that go in against any of my southern armies there because they're a bit exposed. Agents, you know, when you start building up stacks of, say, um, three or four together, then um, he's bound to go for weaker areas, you know, like Marseille. So in France, um, I'm going to go for his... Um, uh, for sabotaging his um, staff college. 21% chance, not bad. Oh, successful mission as well. That's very good. Um, he was, I did check it by the way, he was recruiting. Oh, yeah, look, nothing now. He was recruiting a lot in there. He's not recruiting anything at all now in there. So, uh, next after France is Cleves. Now, this chap here in Cleves, I could really do with him sabotaging um, some armies to stop them moving and bringing up troops. Oh, look at that. I think I'm going to have to sabotage the building instead. Only 14% chance. Oh, yes. Very good. That's very lucky. Very, very lucky for me, that. Um, it hasn't wiped out his recruitment this time, though, has it? I don't quite know why that is, but uh, anyhow, no matter. That's good news. He's not bringing extra troops there from Cleves. I was hoping to take Cleves as well, actually, so I was in a bit of doubt as to whether I should go for that, but it might be just a little bit too far forward for me at this stage. So if I s prevent him from recruiting there, that's probably a good thing, because it's probably going to be a couple of turns before I get to him, isn't it? So at least it stops him producing possibly an army, another four troops from there. So, OK, what have we got here? He's miles away. Um, I forgot which one it was I clicked on there. Is it East Prussia? No. Greater Poland. He's not moving, so let's get him somewhere where he might be able to do something useful. Uh, now then, Silesia. Uh, oh, is that the one I've just moved? Oh, he's just moved to Silesia, hasn't he, when I uh, got, got over to him. Uh, Mecklenburg I can do nothing with. Oh, there's another... What's this one then? Is there another Silesia one that I've missed? Right, OK, that's it now, isn't it? And then there's just Liège, isn't there? So... Just have a quick look around there, just to see if there's anything, you know, any gentlemen around there that maybe we could hit. No, I can't see anything at all in there. There's nothing that we can go for there at all, is there? There was, though, um, the chance of repairing something, wasn't there, that I was going to leave. It's this, isn't it? I could repair that. And also, I think there's... What is there here? Ah, now maybe this is the one that's most important to repair. Yeah, 1277. I'm going to repair that, actually. Out of all the things I can repair, that's the one that I'm definitely going to repair, I think. I don't think I really need to be recruiting any more troops, so these aren't quite so important to me, I don't think. Um, I'll get rid of that, and that, and that. And I'm not going to recruit this time, because I don't want to eat into my money. I'm going to get 9,000 next turn. Um, I think I've already checked, but I'll just check again. Britain are back trading with me, aren't they? It's just Portugal that's being raided there, isn't it? Just have a quick check down here on the ships, because I can't remember now. Uh, where I was up to. It's been quite some time since I looked at the campaign map. So these chaps here are... Um, who are they? Ah! They're the ironclads, aren't they? So Actually, they could do with moving, really. Um, it's nice to defend the spice area there, but I, I'm just not convinced, really, that there's anything dangerous enough to tackle me at the moment around here. But they're strong enough there, so I'm going to go this way. Because it will show anything that's exposed over there, won't it? Maybe I'll go towards um, Corsica. I'm a bit concerned that this now, this steam dry dock, might be good enough to be able to start producing um, some ships. So if he produces ships from there, I won't see them, and they'll come straight through to here, won't they? So, I mean, it's probably just as well if he's going that way, I would have thought. So, let's just see if there are any other merchant ships on their way. I might as well move them while I'm here. Yes, there are, actually. So, just move those into position on here. Okay, two, four, six, and that takes me up to eight, doesn't it? Okay, um, and then I've got another two coming, I'm sure, fairly soon anyway. So, you know, I think I saw a bridge near Hanover that I might be able to defend. Um, I'm, I'm just looking around here at something else, of course. But um, I, if I could defend that bridge nearby, it might be better than defending the town um, over here. What if I could reach that bridge? I can, you know. Might be better for me to defend that bridge. He's not going to get over there, is he? Ah. 
I think that's a better option for me, you know. What about any of, can any of these reach it? I've already moved them now, haven't I? Yeah. I think I'm going to go for defending that bridge, you know. 